Happy Smurf Day. It's hard to believe, but the famous blue and white Belgian cartoon characters turn 50 years old today. They were originally known as Les Grumpfs when they first appeared in a French comic strip in 1958. Now, they weren't a particular favourite of mine when I was younger, but their appeal's been worldwide since the comic strip became a cartoon in 1981. And these fans who've gathered at the Belgian Museum of Fine Arts in Brussels just can't get enough. They're cute, but they all have like their own little character and they're all dressed really cutely, like little flowers, and I love Smurfette shoes. and <laughs> it's, They've got cute little stories. We grew up watching the Smurfs and Smurfette being the only female Smurf, and as an, as an adult, that makes the mind boggle. <laughs> but um, Gargamel, I, you can't explain why they're so cute, really. They just are. Willem de Grave is well-placed to talk about the Smurfs, working as he does at the centre for Belgian comic strips. And he's got his own theory as to why the little blue characters are so well-loved. Besides, it's also interesting that they have almost a perfect society. Uh, you have 101 Smurfs all living together in the village. And every Smurf has his uh, qualities, but also his uh, bad ones. But anyhow, uh, they manage to uh, have a perfect society. And uh, all together they enjoy life and uh, they have fun. The Smurfs may be 50 years old today, but they can always be trusted to bring out the children in most people.